I was born in New York City and I'm Colombian. New York City is where salsa was born, but Cali, Cali, Colombia, that is where salsa lives. At 26, I chose to go back and live in Cali. That's where I met Carlos Ceballos, and he changed my life. I was integrated into this incredible community of dancers. My friend once asked me, can two women or two men dance together? And I said, of course. I see this all the time. I see it in clubs and rehearsals, and my absolute favorite is to see it in competition. It's called the same gender category. So one person leads and the other person follows, and they are both of the same gender. So it's the expression of femininity or masculinity that is really impressive. This is interesting because Colombian salsa is so athletic, and the performance of gender is such an important component. And this project is really about that. It is about the way in which people of all genders, sexes, and orientations are empowered to perform masculinity, and more so to perform femininity through this sport, through dance. Cali, Colombia is a pretty traditional place, but this community of dancers, they are progressive in their own way. Now that I can reflect on my experience in Cali as an intellectual and as an artist, I want to document it. This documentary, I think, is a part of a larger conversation about gender and what it looks like for mostly gay and trans salsa dancers in Latin America, in Colombia, to lead the way on that topic. To complete production for this project, I will need to hire a crew, cover travel costs, and rent equipment. I would love your support in any way you feel is possible. It is a huge undertaking and I can't wait to get to work.